Is this thing on? Is it on? The summer of 1982, the year Poltergeist became America's paranormal hit movie. The documentary The Atomic Cafe brought forth government conspiracies surrounding nuclear and atomic energy. And it was the summer that Edward Spritzer and his gang of Satan worshippers went on a killing rampage that left eight victims bloodied and dead. But all of this could not prepare one tiny Texas town for the nightmare that would unfold in the summer of 82. Was it supernatural? Was it alien abduction? Was it devil worship? Was it a government conspiracy? Yes. This is a true story. A story the size of Texas in one of the state's smallest towns. If I tell you what I know, then you will know. If they find out that you know, they will f***ing kill you. I'm telling you, man. They will f***ing kill you. In the teens. Mm -hmm. They prayed. They really believed in God. They didn't act like animals. Today, we're going to be worse than what they ever thought. Imagine what we'll do. I've heard uh, Lisa told me that J.M., Harris, and Kenneth all probably died from the grief. I remember there's some strange things that happened here, you know. You know, she had problems. It's not her fault, you know. You know, it just, mm -hmm. uh, they call it a generic thing. That, what can you do, you know? Yeah. You ask me, you know. Well, now, now, he sold it because they talked talking shit about him and his family of crooks and all that filthy stuff. Yeah. And they got a man that's watching. They said, just because you don't see me don't mean I ain't watching your ass. Because, <laughs> you know, you think I'm bullshit? No, I believe you. Like what happened that summer? It's just, I don't even know. I, I, I really don't even know where to be begin. I mean, my my whole life, I've wondered wondered what could have made an entire town lose their minds. But they just walk the street. They would, but you never saw the sisters. You never saw them do anything except just walk and blah 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 talking. <laughs> what about to the? Themselves. But the sisters were always hidden. Just. I never saw their sisters. I never saw them out. I don't know. That's crazy, isn't it? I don't know. They we're living. But he got the rope around his neck or something. That's a thing on the. Oh, the blind. Blinds. Blinds. Got it around his neck. 
She just walked in and found him. Yeah. She got it around, did No, the mother did. Well, I know Dorothy was mean there to that, wasn't she? Oh, she. She got violent. Dixon. Dixon. Got shot and then the guy pulled out on Rogers on Blue Mountain Road there and killed us. Well, that was, that that was that was back. Is that the one you were talking about? Maybe that was it. Yeah, where he pulled Rogers. out on the road and just killed himself. Yeah, that was Dixon Rogers. Yeah, that was got shot. And the guy that shot him killed himself. Where? The uh, I think I Greg, Greg, somebody can't remember his last name. Right across from the Boyle's house, he killed his he killed his mother and father and sister, and then killed this kid and said that he walked in while he was killing him and he ended up killing him somehow.